Hey everyone, welcome back to Rogue Legacy 2. Last time, we found out a way to get to a secret entrance that should help us with this second boss. Today, we're going to actually try to make good on what we found and actually get the items. So, this duelist not only is better at navigating through the area thanks to the wolf, they also have the Icarus wings. So, they can cheese getting through the area. So, the combination of which is quite effective. Or at least it should be quite effective. Alright. So, we're just going to start midway through so that we can get there sooner. It might, this might lead to us, unfortunately, not having enough gold to buy anything, but I think it's preferable to give us the greatest opportunity. Well, actually, I can still get treasure chests that are easy. This. And this should be, ow, oh, it's one of those treasure chests. I can't jump over this, so I have to go through. And now I'm not. There we are. Okay, so that was pretty simple. Let's see, the next treasure chest is way ahead and way down. So, in other words, I'm not going to find the next sort of chest I have to. Yeah, I was going to say, this is too valuable of an area to just go through. I gotta start using that more often, because it just recharges every two seconds. I wonder if that 10 means it actually can recharge 10 mana if it's at precise angle or something like that. Here we are. Path revealed by the light. Just that be better safe than sorry. Because yeah, let's see. Right here, there's a hidden back entrance into the observation room that's revealed in the lights. Perhaps I'll find my answers there. It's the gatehouse observation room. Like, it just sounds like it's the path to the left, but to have found this information, I have to have already taken the path to the left. Um, so in case you're wondering why I'm saying, um, at the very beginning of this huge map over here, um, this place right here, there's a gatehouse, but the reason I think that they're not talking about that one is to get the information to know that's there. You have to, well, have gotten the item in that gatehouse already. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's a stretch right there. That's well. Also gives me food. Icarus means is just such an amazing item. Oh my gosh. I should be as much as I should feel I should be at the very least. Oh my gosh, yeah, that that one right there just 
sealed the deal effectively. Gotta find chicken or else I basically have killed myself before I have found the item I was here looking for in the first place. And in case you're wondering, I'm saving my mana so I can actually open the door at the end of all of this. Alright. Kurgulin Gate House. Please keep all metals off the soil. Please do not cut your branches while walking. So the lights reveal the secret entrance. Lights reveal the secret entrance. Let me read that one more time. The back door is revealed in the lights. The back door to the Kagulin gatehouse. Is there another way to get all the way over here? I just, I need to figure out where this secret entrance is. of dying. Beautiful. I don't... I know usually secret doors can be kicked. I don't see how the secret entrance is revealed by these. I'm thinking if I kick them all, but that doesn't seem to be doing anything. Alright, let's see. All metals off the soil. Do not cut any branches while walking through the undergrowth. Do not disturb the wildlife. That makes me think it's at the floorboards. But it's revealed by the lights. Let's see, three wildlife there. Three wildlife there. I'm sorry if I'm just kind of doing it. Nothing. I'm trying to figure out this puzzle. I have no idea. I only know that the puzzle is here. And that's the fire for the boss fight, so that's not. Well, Alright. I'm not winning this boss fight with this in my current conditions. But right here there's some bunch of items. This is the Agartha Gatehouse, so this is not what they are talking about. But yeah, this is why I was thinking, like, maybe they're talking about this, because you have to jump off the lights to get here. But, again, to get anywhere to the gatehouse, you have to... Wait. There's a bunch of lights down there.
I'm trying to think. Maybe there's a thing if I all the lights in here lead to it. Hmm. So that's the shrine. Because, yeah, you have to get this heirloom in order to enter the area at all. Yeah, these lights aren't giving me anything, I don't think. Yeah, no. So this area is a dud. So it's not this. So, the back door to the Kugulin Gatehouse is revealed in lights. Am I trying to find the Kugulin Gatehouse? Because this is the Kugulin Gatehouse, and it says so right here. So somehow these lights reveal the path. I have no idea what it means these lights reveal the path. Right up here. I mean, there's no lights here, but I'm like, might as well try. So the reason I'm kicking is usually kicking bounces off of secret entrances. I just have no idea what it wants me to do. And yeah, I'm not entering that boss with 20% health. I already learned enough about the boss that's going to get me killed. Like, yeah, it makes sense. There's a strange section of... The lights are in a strange formation at the Kirk Killing Gatehouse. But I don't know what it wants me to do with them. I'm going to go back and try one more time. I think if I fail with... Actually, no, I need to get my 150 mana first. Still no. Alright. Max mana. And yeah, I, here. Let's read it again. So, bridge four. Let's see, questions like these. How did the beast get past our defenses? Why was no one with the presence? I was against throwing bodies in that gatehouse. The cold of nearby Kugulin Plateau would have preserved the bodies far better. Regardless, my gut knows something is wrong. It's about time I learn not to ignore it. Perhaps I'll find a way into the get house observation. The guards there would have kept records of the night's events. There's a hidden back entrance into the observation room that's revealed in the lights. So it's at the Kugulin Plateau. It's at Kugulin Gatehouse. But there's a hidden back entrance to the observation room that's revealed in the lights. I don't... Yeah, I just don't know. 
I'll again I'll go there one more time. Ugh. And yeah, after that I'm just like I don't want to spend all my time just staying here staring at a puzzle. by the lights. Oh. Get some money real fast. Alright. Field by the lights. Oh! Do you see that? So, it looks like the shadows on the lights up there don't fit. I'm gonna get a better view. Come on. No, I didn't. It's supposed to be right here, but every time I use my spell, it doesn't help. So it's not right here. Then where is it? I just, man, I don't know. It should be there from what I'm gathering, but I'm not gathering it right, obviously, because it's not there. I, oh my gosh. So I'll have three. Melt on soil. Okay, branches. I feel like that's information that's going to give. That's more important when I get to the Google area. It's just. Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Is it here, under this light? Nope. Well, I'm out of ideas. Let's get myself killed. Maybe get to know this boss a little better. Void Beast, part of the Legion. Oh, I can just... Yeah. 
function him. Yep, just... I don't know if the cooldown was ready yet. Huh. Oh my gosh. Well, I'll have to figure out next time. Ib muscle fibers. You have good taste. Alright. Sir Teddy could probably make it, but... This gives me new traits to figure out. Alright, enemies are knocked five away, plus hold Z to super jump. Well, that could probably make it as well. So, Barbarian's still level 2 and Ranger's still level 1. Other than that... Oh, good. And there's still... So there's still two, three, four, five runes that are still not found. So there's still some chance that the vampire rune is in there. Oh. Let's see, I have 105. That's 725. That's 1075. I will not have enough money for both. So let's buy something here. Is preferably cheap enough I can afford the other thing. Or I could just buy more meditation. Honestly, this will probably help me get to the boss better. Ugh. I'm just lost for that puzzle. So annoyed that I don't know. Uh. All right. I wonder is. Alright, so it is considered an attack. Because for some reason the roll does not, even though that deals damage. Oh yeah, I'm gaining mana. Why don't I just. Uh. Oh my gosh. Not worth it. Horribly. I don't know if that was just bad positioning or what, but that just was horrible. Alright. Alright. Nice game, meat. I just, I have all the information. I just, I don't know how the lights are supposed to guide me. Oh my gosh. I might just need to get more comfortable with those attacks coming at me. 
That might just be the way I get through this. Like learning the delay timings well enough that I can just accept that I'm being targeted. Hey, Skellies. Okay, there's weird lag issues again. Hopefully that's not coming out on the video too much. Expand that whenever projectiles start coming at you. It's just too much. It's too powerful. But not only like spam it, but gain mana for spamming it. Here we are. Get more steel. 150. Needed to get to 200 just to open upgrade one um, leather item. So, gonna be a while. So. Oh, we're already here. Whoever it is, it's not dependent on this. It's not dependent on the ground around it, at least. I just... Yeah, I just don't know. Just flat out, I don't know. Just flat out. Alright. I wonder if I could just jump over it with this character. Alright. Let's just try to beat it. Alright, so when it rotates like that, I don't need to jump over it. And when he does this, just spin. Get a cool. right. Yeah, and this I can just jump over. Okay, that's how you do that. Spin. Oh well. But yeah, I just don't know what's trying to get me to do. Great sword. Boy, spellow. 
Blaze's Bell will let me just try a bunch of the walls, so that might be worthwhile. Very well. Okay, actually, this would be amazing if I wasn't going for boss fights. If I'm going for money, this is amazing. Because the ability to drop meat while recovering your ability by collecting meat. Yeah. This is just good air overall. Alright, we have 1235. It should be enough to buy another warden item. Yep, specifically the warden chest. Do I still have bonus focus? I do. But now I have the great armor. Alright. Well, next time, I think I'm just going to go try to beat that boss. Like, I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. I don't know how to solve that puzzle right now. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.